Well, it's one of the most mysterious and unanswered questions of our lifetime. Are there aliens among us? And this week, that question was being asked over and over again, from Congress to the military to foreign governments. And now NASA is taking a closer look, too. NBC's Gotti Schwartz has more. Whether you're a believer or not, the question of aliens on Earth is here and now. NASA, the agency most associated with space exploration, has entered the UFO fray. I personally believe in a universe that is so vast that could there be a replication of life on Earth elsewhere? Of course I believe that. The agency releasing a 36-page report Thursday on Unidentified Anomalous Phenomena, or UAP. Their conclusion, there's no proof aliens exist, but they might. NASA saying UAP presents a unique scientific opportunity and that the agency should play an essential role in studying the subject. That report coming directly on the heels of a sensational revelation in Mexico. No estamos solos en este vasto universo. Supposed ancient alien bodies. Jaime Mausan, a self-described UFOologist, revealing two figures to the Mexican Congress claiming they were not of this earth. But Mausan has made unfounded claims in the past that turned out to be hoaxes. So in the world of UFO and UAP experts, there's some skepticism. This past July, former intelligence officer Major David Grush testified in front of Congress that the U.S. is concealing a long-standing UFO program. I was informed in the course of my official duties of a multi-decade uh, UAP crash retrieval and reverse engineering program. The Pentagon's UFO office has denied Grush's claims, but lawmakers are looking for answers. Do you believe UAPs pose a potential threat to our national security? Yes. <laughs> All of this talk of what else might be out there is reducing the UFO stigma. More folks are coming forward, including New York Jets quarterback Aaron Rodgers, who recently talked about a UFO encounter he says he had years ago on the show Hard Knocks. When we heard the sound and we saw this tremendously large object moving through the sky. And if the truth is somewhere out there, now it's official, NASA is on the case too. All right, a little spooky. That was Gotti Schwartz reporting there. And NASA has even created a new position to help lead their efforts into determining if UFOs and UAPs are real. That's the big question. Okay, so I'm going to ask you this question, Matt okay. Rescone. No. <laughs> what do you think? I guess I could have just looked in there. What know, question are you going to ask? <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you, well, do you think that there are aliens among us? Well, I mean, what do you mean among us? Does that mean they're on this earth with us? Or does that mean just like out this? there? Let's just out say in, yeah, in existence. Yes. yes. Among uh, us. They're here. <laughs> it's Laura. Laura. Studio it like. A. She's an alien. <laughs> <laughs> like among us. Where I'm thinking of men in black and, you know, you don't know where they are. But yeah, I think that in the universe, yeah. I'm really? a believer. You are I a agree. believer. Yeah. yeah, I think the universe is too big for there not to be some sort of itty bitty little life form. I don't think it needs to be a full blown like green man. Yeah, I was but, like a say, little life form. I don't think of aliens the same way that yes. movies portray them. So it looks like we're all in agreement day. here. Oh yeah, yeah, it's okay. something, something. Mm -hmm.